Welcome back to Ultra Despair Girls. Let's go ahead and equip Auto Lock just because I want to show it off. We have a couple. We're going to be getting skills throughout this game, and I at least want to showcase them as soon as we get them because some of the skills are absolute crap, and I don't want to keep them for very long. No kidding. Our quest is still off to the bridge, but uh, there's a few things that we can do up until then. Like what? Like pick up extra goodies. <laughs> Oh, remember this from the first game? Uh, yeah. That's, that's a thing. That's definitely a thing. Okay, I'm gonna level with you guys. We haven't done this since uh, October. <sighs> Sorry, other stuff came before it. So, uh, continuing on. If we happen to repeat something, don't hold it against us. Nah, hold it against us hardcore. We don't <laughs> care. We can, take, we can take it. That's right. Just comment all the time that we suck and we suck... And hey, how about another... What is this? Oh. Oh, oh hell. No. Oh, hell. Like yeah, so here's a uh, lovely first grader puzzle that we need to deal with right here. I, I spelled a curse in the hallway. <laughs> I spelled a curse word, and it's just like... Uh, you, you remember back in school when you used to spell words with a calculator and then turn it upside down and it would spell like boobs or something like that? I, w I thought I was so smart for spelling boobies. It's very impressive, especially with newer calculators where they don't have the precise numbers. Anyway, what we need to do with that is solve a puzzle. I used to have a book full of really interesting <laughs> ways to, like, puzzles for... Yeah. Yeah, so read hell upside down is 7734! We did it. You know, I forget that we're dealing with children here. They're not the smartest of uh, puzzle masters, after all. <laughs> But hey, at least they're going with elementary school logic. So hopefully Komaro knows what the hell she's doing enough to where she can best these kids. See, look at that. She's so happy. Bring it on, kids. Uh, it sounds like that she's rubbing it in for uh, beating a first grader. Yeah, she is. She, she's not that bright. It's like you beat him in hopscotch. She's like, yeah, what? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Flip a table, kick them down a flight of stairs. Ugh! You don't fucking mess with me on my goddamn street. <laughs> And then it becomes West Side Story because you beat them in hopscotch. <laughs> oh, hey, guess what? What? The fucking bridge. The bridge. Well, if we make it to that, make it across that bridge, we're home free. It's monokuma colored. It's probably evil. Let's not go there. Oh, maybe. I mean, what if it isn't? What if this is the one monokuma themed thing that isn't evil? Well, then the series of Jump the Shark. And well, who cares if it's Jump the Shark? I mean, it's not like some of the other games in the series jump that shark. They jump it multiple times, in fact. Right into the ground where it belongs. <laughs> Down to the Earth's core. I think there was an execution like that at one point. Yeah. So cool. Why would kids do such shitty things? I blame smartphones. <laughs> These damn millennials killing adults like it ain't no thing. You're right. God, that makes me sound old now that I'm blaming millennials. We are millennials, dude. I know! Oh, I'm blaming my own kind. Man against man. Why do they hate the adults? Let me count the ways. <laughs> Oh, dear lord. So anyway, about what our president tweeted this morning. Anyway, I'm not going to get on that, sorry. What did he tweet this morning? Oh, it was that stupid. <sighs> You're saying the Democrats will never get their ways if we repeal guns, so I'm not going to do it. Oh, right. Yeah, that. Well, hey, we have to have guns, otherwise we end up using fucking bullhorns. <laughs> so wait, are you saying this is our future right now? Well, yeah. Doesn't this take place in the distant future or something like that? Uh, not in the not-too-distant future, actually. So, yeah. If we keep gun laws going the way they're going, we're going to be shooting Monokumas with megaphones. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I was about to say it's not as bad as I think, but yeah, it, it, it would be as bad. Because then everybody would have a Battle Royale staller style 
blow-up collar, and I don't think anybody wants that. Okay, so I know kids, they'll probably get bored of the corpse within five minutes and probably kill somebody else, and then by the end of the week they'll probably kill everybody in the goddamn city, they'll be so bored they'll end up killing each other, so all we gotta do is just, uh, find a rock to hide under and wait it out. Oh, that might help. Because kids are stupid, dumb creatures, and that's why it's so fun to see an entire terrorist organization brought up by stupid, dumb children. <laughs> And to defeat them, we have to rely on stupid, dumb children. Mm, yeah, we need to rely on somewhat smarter, but not as much teenagers to help take down the the cruddy kids. It's like a reverse kids next door. Yeah, right. Yes! All we gotta do now is cross the bridge! Alright. One of the best parts of the game, the bridge. Wait a minute, there's how many chapters? There's no way it's gonna be this easy. I, I have a bad feeling Besides, about we've seen other exits that we can go to in this level. What means that? Uh... What? Blam! Oh. Fire's a rocket. You guys don't look like you're with those kids. Hmm. That means you're on my side, right? Right? Well... Huh? Didn't I last see this kid in Pokemon Sun and Moon? <laughs> Alola, cousin! I knew it. Yes. Oh, this is fantastic! Man, it's been forever since I've seen a normal person! Hey, wait a minute. So this kid happy. looks familiar. I hate this kind of guy. Just walking up and talking to a girl like it was... Gundam Tanaka, of course! Uh, I think this handshake is over now. <laughs> I think his mind broke. Hey, how much longer uh, are you gonna hold her hand? You're like a creepy fan meeting an idol. That's right, we can all relate to that. Oh, it's not like that. It's just this wristband. <gasps> You're one of the marked ones. Are you also captured by those kids who call themselves the Warriors of Hope? <laughs> that's <Huh>? stupid. <laughs> Warriors of Hope. <laughs> and then you got out here and yep. We hope you get used to kids killing other people. Me too. We just gotta wait until they crash from their sugar high and they take their nap and then we slit their throats. It's easy. Whoa, that's, that's a little dark, isn't it? How many people have they killed? Let's get dark. <laughs> Are you saying there's a certain threshold of how dark it can get before we can be dark back? I'm just saying we need to mete out an accurate punishment for the atrocities they've committed. Mm -hmm. Thus far and beyond. Well, they're kids, though. Do you put them in juvie, or do you just put them on a firing range? No, we try them as adults, and yeah. <laughs> so they burn, no matter what. Well, yeah. You can't fix that, unless you want to have a Michael Myers story, and look what happened to him. It didn't. What are you doing? Oh, this? If you want to really remember a name... Oh my god, it's a callback. I think I realize who this person is. If it wasn't the last name, it certainly is the mannerisms. That was from Yu-Gi-Oh! when they made the power of friendship to help fill in the heart of the cards. Oh, that was the perfect time for the word friend to show up in a text box. Friend. Who's this? She's been, um, glaring at me this whole time. Oh, Toko? She's the realist of the group. You remind me of somebody, but it's been like three or four years since I last played the game, so I don't really remember who you actually are. You don't have to make introductions like this. Not for an outcast. All right, I'm, uh, I'm going to throw this out there for people who haven't played this game before. There are throwbacks to the first game everywhere. In fact, there is a throwback for every single student that attended Hope Speak Academy in the first game. Now let's hurry up and get out of this town. But they never actually say it. They just say, it's that girls, or that boys, or that spat special ones. It's just like, eh, 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 you remember? Hey, come on, Dragon and Rapa, da 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 Some of them are as obvious as Utah here. Some other ones are basically just a, a passing glance. It's just like, oh, hey, this is so-and-so's dog, I think, is one of them at one point. <laughs> Time to get out of here. Yeah! You ever think they'll make uh, an Ultra Despair Girls 2 with characters no. from Danganronpa 2 and no. maybe 3? Oh, no way. 
There is no possible way at this point. Especially huh. with what I know now, there is no fucking way. <laughs> Yuna, slow down. Oh, he's a quick one. Well, you know, he's fast, but he's That's right. slow. Hurry, yeah. Oh, and if you think I'm missing anything on the sidelines, don't worry about it. Trust me. Once we're out of this town, let's celebrate by toasting with sports drinks. Sports drinks? Sports drinks. Like Gatorade over the head. Well, it's Japan, so it'll probably be Pokari sweat. Ugh. Well, there goes our hope. Are you kidding me? Oh no! Oh, it's no. like we Well, I wanna know where the city went. <laughs> I was just thinking that. There was a city over there. Where the <laughs> fuck did it go? It's just ocean now. Uh, well, uh, limitations of the hardware, I guess. Limitation? No, no it's just a simple back. <laughs> they got one right over there. How can they not? <laughs> There's actually a giant veil over it. It's, or a giant matte painting of the sky. Right away because things got a little screwed up. If you have the energy to shout and scream like that, use it to move your weak ass instead. We need to dance to repair the bridge. Uh -huh. Oh, wasn't that in a Rhythm Heaven game at one point? Just go back to the city. This part of the bridge might be unstable as well. Uh-oh. Go back? You want us to actually go back there? What choice do we have? Yes. That's the only way. Again, Toko the Realist. Like, what's so strange about that? It's like, well, go well, this way is out, and uh, unless if you want to feel like uh, swimming in freezing cold water, you know, might as well go back. Oh, we need to go back the way we came with us a dead end! Yeah, of course! Oh, uh, this is why I like the dynamic between the two, because Toko's the one who's seen some shit. Kamaro has no idea. So when you hear Toko talk, it's basically, well, yeah, it's the obvious choice. There is one law in this place, and it is the law of Murphy. Eddie Murphy? Or the actual Murphy's law. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a twist? <laughs> Turns out the most terrible, awful, most tragic event in human history was Eddie Griffin getting another movie trilogy. Or Norbert getting a sequel. Ah! Uh-oh! All right, so we need to make it back off the bridge in three minutes. Three and a half minutes, excuse me. Time bomb set, escape immediately. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So uh, let's take as long as we can because they gave a, they give you way too much time to get off this bridge. The main thing they want you to do is just stop and attack all the Monokumas, but really you don't have to up to a certain point. You can just escape. Oh, no, it's very slowly and gradually sinking. Mm-hmm. Like, those bombs seem pretty definitive, but no, it will give you three and a half minutes to do it. Here's where you hit your first roadblock, though. You need to kill the bomber, Monokuma, in order for him to take out the rest of them. Oops. Before they take you out. That's right. I I'm, I'm not doing too well. I'm playing this on Vita TV, and surprisingly, it's kind of difficult. So much better on PS4. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I actually have the PS4 version, and honestly, I can't tell the two versions apart. Feels better. They all control the same! I mean, would you rather use a DualShock 4 controller, or would you rather use a PS Vita? I'd rather use a DualShock 4, because it feels better for a shooter. I am using a DualShock 4. Well, then what's your problem? Oh, I'm bad at third-person shooters! <laughs> well, fine! <laughs> By the way, we did it. Yay, hooray. Oh, and probably obvious if you don't reach it in the time limit automatic game over no duh i, I just wait, know somebody's wait, going to say what? what happens if you don't make it you die no you get a hundred dollars of course you die <laughs> I, I thought we were gonna die yeah we only had like we're two whole down. minutes to get 50 feet away <laughs> Uh-oh. Well, oh dear. Now we have Absolutely no chance. There is no possible way that we might be able to, I don't know, dive into the water and swim away. I guess you could say there's zero escape. Ooh, damn, that was good. 
With the wristbands and everything, how is it up? It's obvious. Well, with all the despair I've felt so far, I've prepared myself. Mm -hmm. And if I don't do everything I can, I know that nothing's gonna get solved. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Stretching for despair. I'm, do I'm doing what Sonic does, because Sonic's my hero. <laughs> Gotta go fast. Yeah. I put my hair like his. <laughs> that is true. Oh my god, he loves Sonic. You fucking weeb. <laughs> Doesn't that make you a weeb too? Hey, glass houses, I'm gonna break my window, thank you very much. <laughs> As you're tossing a brick at this doofus. <laughs> hey. It's a doofus worth hitting. I can pay to fix the window if it means hitting him. Yeah, that looks pretty tiring. But the water is freezing, and with all the pollution, uh, there are weird creatures in there. Then I guess I'll just be extra careful. Yeah, okay. No, it's not that. I'm telling you not to try it, <laughs> idiot swimmer. D don't be a hero. Idiot swimmer? <laughs> But I'm on the track team! I'll run on the water! Anyway, this isn't the time to rush into things. Let's think this out. Yeah, maybe we can, like, I don't know, fly out or the just, you know, find a bandsaw and get the wristbands off. Maybe we so could stack scissors that Toko has and just reason? climb across. I don't know. All I have to do is yeah, we can call Flying Nimbus. Foundation guys after I cross, hmm. Right? You know, if we take a bunch of scissors and put them on your finger and then spin them around, it can turn into a helicopter blade. Wait for me until then, okay? No, no, please don't. Um, be careful. If you run into any trouble, come back right away, okay? <laughs> 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 oh man, that's funny. But, but I seriously do hope he comes back. <clears throat> what a fucking loser. Yeah, I would just be blown to pieces if something were to happen to him. This just blows me away on how fast he's swimming. He has such an explosive personality. I mean, look at that enthusiasm. That's just dynamite, man. And that smile, bang, just... Boom! Well, he's out of here, my buddy. He had a pretty explosive entrance and exit. Fun fact: half of those drops are actually Utah. <laughs> <laughs> well, behold, absolute despair. Introduce a brand new character and then kill them off immediately.